a hot one today. It's 31, I think, expected here, and it's 36 degrees C, whatever that is in Fahrenheit. It's going to be out to where we're heading to Cam Killer Bun, or the Bun, the Bun Pub, uh, which is apparently a nice pub. Been there once before. Yeah, the Bun Pub. It's in the middle of nowhere, lovely old pub. A little bit of old machinery around it. Um, but uh, hopefully we can get in there today. We haven't booked. We think it, hey, it's a Thursday and we really don't think there'll be that many people there. We could be very wrong. We get there and there could be a, a party or something. Lots and lots of motorcyclists out this time of year. It's summer in Australia and uh, there's a lot of people who've still got holidays, like myself. Um, so, yeah, lots of people out going for a ride while it's nice and warm. For me, I would rather go in the middle of winter in Queensland um, because it's chilly mornings and beautiful days. about the riding season where you know, I don't go during winter, it's too damn cold. I'm not, so I, I go into what I don't go in the summer. We've got five of us today, that's uh, magic. Got a bit of some good Aussie music in. Uh One, two, three, four. Reggie at the back. Five. Reggie's away. Good work, Reg. Oh, well, just after ten. Um, that guy that wanted a later ride didn't show, so. Bit of bad luck. To organise rides which suit the majority of the group. Today worked out well as I said. I dropped my daughter at work. So that's all fine and dandy. But uh, yeah, it should be a nice day. Hello ladies. Everyone loves a spider. Got no friends, buy a spider, as they say. <laughs> I chew at his ear about the spider. So uh, yeah, that was pretty good. Anyway, all a bit of fun. All a bit of fun. Oof. Anyway, so we're, we're off to Cam Killabun um, via some little backways and some little towns. So yeah, along the way we'll take some footage and just enjoy ourselves. And Cruise for the day. Have a, a early lunch at Camp Killabun Pub. Been on a bit of a country road, but a yeah, bit of enjoyable scenery. <laughs> My side, your side. You too. <laughs> oh. Welcome to Australia, folks. I just realised that 
um, thankfully it is this way. People around the world probably think uh, the Australians have been pulling our legs for a long time now. There's a uh, lot of videos that tend to show too many kangaroos in them. Um, you do spot the occasional one, but it's because in the middle of the day, the old Skippy, he goes and sits under a tree. He's a bit smarter than the average bear. So, uh, yeah. I've only got a small bear, but they've got a very smart animal. Elevation is out here at Hayden. Have, uh, have to look that up. It's uh, up reasonably high in the area. Oh, look at that view back down the valley there. That's just magic. Oh! 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 oh. I hope that comes through on the camera. Bit of a oomph. big ruts there from trucks and it just scraped something low Ooh, that wasn't very nice anyway carry on welcome to Haddon or Hayden nice little spot about 30, 30 minute ride Today, that if you want to make friends, and meet people, get yourself a spider because uh, it's just what happens. Uh, we just happened to pull up at Hayden, so I quickly we grab a drink and a toilet stop if anyone does because it's a bit of a ride from here to Camp Killiburn. Uh, but uh, you know, now is a good time to do it, and uh, that's not good habit. There's some people there that. Um, but uh, a few people knew, uh, and the lady is a photographer, uh, that's her passion and hobby, she uh, judges it at uh, the ECA, the Royal Show in Brisbane, and so uh, yeah, she, that's in there, and they, uh, yeah, they want to have a chat and look at the bikes, they took a heap of photos, and yeah, it's one of those things, she's telling us how her, her dad was born in 1910 and she sat in a 1910 Harley and yeah so yes if you uh if you want to meet people and make friends get yourself a spider <laughs> people love them and uh most of the people that I've met that ride them are pretty good people too which is really good about to come down towards the uh, intersection with the OQ yard road and uh, we finally got back onto some dual carriageway stuff uh, and we single track. Yeah, views you get along that ridge there are 
really great. Well, I think the guys down there didn't get I don't think the camera does it justice. It never ceases to amaze me the people that want to come up and, and have a chat about the spiders and, and uh, there's just a, there's something different about them. Um, and people think they, they look great and odd and whatever and they want to talk about them but the great thing about them is that they're not just a piece to attract attention, although they do and people want to talk with you know, most of us are pretty accommodating and want to tell them about them but they're actually really nice to ride um, mine's not at the moment, it's got a, a dodgy rear shock but I'll guarantee you that if you put two dodgy rear shocks in my car uh, it'll be the same but once I get that fixed in the next couple of weeks it'll be beautiful to ride again um, they are, they're a beautiful machine so yeah, they're a friend maker, but they're a beautiful machine. So here we are in Paranga. Nice little town, Paranga. Whew, bit of air. Oh, I want that shed there. That's my shed. That'd be awesome. A caravan at one end, a couple of spiders in the other. Oh, yeah, and they are in Quintalo. Better make sure I've got everything on here before we go racing away. So I'm making the truck doing that. Yeah, it's going past. That was a good opportunity to make sure everyone was on. I can see Doug back there. He's the back one. That's awesome. Oof. Oh, I don't think the store is serving anymore. <laughs> oh, cheap house. Big shed. Alright, see the sign there on the left? Uh, I thought I might store that one. We've got Ken Pillabun and then we got Dolby. Not Dalby, Dolby. <laughs> so, for those who haven't been to Queensland before and you're coming to Dolby, it's Dolby, not Dalby, as I've heard it called many times before. Maybe in England they might call it Dalby, but the other issue is Dolby, mate. Dolby. So, uh, yeah, we're not far out of Camp Killiburn now. And, uh, the roads have been pretty damn straight most of the way. I think it's the first corner, or call it a corner. It's basically a big sweep of this, still sitting on 100. Kilometers an hour that is. Um, just the speed limit out here. Uh, yeah, it's pretty straight. A little bit of mulga like this is, but not much. A lot of farmlands, which has been really nice because it's so nice and green. It's uh, really nice. It's a bit cooler though. But, uh, anyway, we'll, uh, we'll choose an earlier time next time. I would have left at 7.30 this morning for a stinging hot day, probably made Dolby and had a coffee normally, but I don't know, she'll be right. Not that bad. I know Keith and them rode on a hotter day the other day, so yeah, it's not too bad. Yeah, this, is, uh, this is nice out here. You can see where they've had the, the sheep in those paddocks there, they're down to nothing. And, uh, yeah, they're trying to get something to grow back in them and it's a bit hard. There's the ones on the right with that uh, cattle in those, so they've got uh, the cows. Will, cows will leave a bit of grass at the top, uh, sorry, at the bottom of the grass bit, but the horses and sheep, I think it's because of their teeth, so they won't do it. Um, there's a bit, of, a bit of a heat haze up, at, up in front there, but I don't know whether it's a heat haze or whether. Oh! Damn! Oh! That's what happens when you have no rear suspension. <laughs> it nearly throws you off. Oi, yep, up and over. Got the whoops. Yeah. Beautiful example. Thank you very much. Whew. <laughs> well, that's, uh, that's the start of Camp Killiburn up there ahead after we nearly came off. 
You okay back there, passenger? Oh wait, there's no passenger. <laughs> Possibly I had no one there. Sure, passenger on the back, probably would have just about lost it off of there then. I hope everyone else is okay. Yeah, we're just coming into Kem uh, Kilaban now, uh, to the pub. Uh, and uh, I reckon we might try and park around the back in their shade areas that they've got. Um, and uh, damn the consequences. <laughs> park in the shade. If they want to tell us different when we get in there, they can, but uh, yeah, we'll try and use their uh, undercover area, which uh, is like just a private car. Here or around the other side? Here, around the other side. Around there? Yeah, go around there. We're going to park around there. That was Cam Killer Bun. Cam Killin Bun. Uh, or the Bun Pub. The Bun Hotel. Uh, had really nice lunch. I had, uh, had some really different foods there. It was really nice food. Had a coffee which was awesome. Uh, service was really quick because we were the only ones there so they fired up the kitchen for us and we had uh, six people almost fired up the kitchen for us. It was awesome. Um, it, I highly recommend um, going to the Bun Pub. I'll, I'll stick a, uh, a link down the bottom. But if you're ever out in the Western Downs area near Dolby, uh, definitely, definitely go to the Camp Killen Bun Pub. It's very, very nice. Very quaint old place, but very nice. All right, we're going to do the, uh, the long straight roads back to home. Uh, it's been a beautiful day out, um, and uh, another great day on the spider. Lots of people want to know about them as always. Um, and, uh, I'm going to go and find somewhere cool and a cool drink because it is stinking hot at 38 degrees. Yeah. 